Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the void. I'm player one, by myself. Welcome back to Xenoblade. Um, like and subscribe. You know the drill. It's it's questing once more. Because there are a lot of quests in this game. Very, very many. Oh my. So yeah, last time we did, um, I wouldn't say that many, but we did get Colony 6 level 2, so that was a big thing. And I'm here in Colony 9, because I realized we, we still have one more to do here, and that's the, the Betty and Desiree one. And that one, we don't talk about that one right now, oh, got Melia. I don't want to do any more story right now, so kind of just, yeah. But yeah, the reason we we still had the Betty one to do is because we needed to get to Aerith Sea to get the stuff. And since I was getting the collectibles from Aerith Sea, I got those things. And I thought that was all we needed to do for the quest, but we still needed something I think was like Vang stuff I don't know it's it's whatever's over here you still need to get some of this stuff and then our quest is done and that's actually the last colony 9 quest until the end of the game the way quests work is that you know it has you know however many and then when you reach the final area Every single area then gets bombarded with quests. So this is technically the last, like... What the hell is this? Hmm. This is like the last regular quest before the end of the game in Colony 9. So that's pretty cool. It'll be good to be done with an area. Kinda of crazy how level 34 enemies are now easy monsters. When we definitely would have got our shit kicked in by a mosquito early in the game. The character development is pretty cool. Alright, there's that. Now, what else do I need? Vang hair clips. Okay. And I would assume Vangs only come out at night. Okay. No mercy. I may as well leave this in, since I don't think it'll take that long. And well, I haven't really left in much of the grindy bits of quests. Usually I just pause it and then the quest is done. You know, it would actually make sense to show some gameplay of the game, you know? Even if I think it's boring, there's probably some people who like it, so...
Alright, there we go. So now, I think I can go to Betty. Hi there. Thanks. It can't have been easy. They're even cuter than I thought. The armor will be just what she needs. Right. She was beautifying her armor. Don't worry about it. It was nothing. Yes, thank you so much. It'll make some armor that will look good on Desiree. By the way, don't tell you got the materials from me. What? She's gonna believe that you got all the stuff? No. I'm never gonna give up. Ooh. Now they're best friends. Yeah, when you look at the Colony 9 section, it is very connected. The only problem I have with the chart is that sometimes, like this one between these two, that's their best affinity. They're not going to get a better one. And that kind of makes me mad. But I guess, you know, just having a link is better than not having a link. And if you can get a good one, you, you should. But if you can't, then, you know, what, what are you going to do? Oh, so this one's just a better... That's just a better one. Of this one. But, what should I replace? Guess I can do that. Right, yeah, let me just double check to make sure. If I've checked everything, the only quest we could do here is Paula and Irene. But I don't have Melia. Sad. Alright. Let us go. Take on another. I'm going to do... The one that Werner gave us, where we have to kill a whole bunch of flyers. No mercy. Can win by okay, let's this out <laughs> oh, oh, it's like that. Beautiful. Ricky probably could win by himself. Ooh, good.
I don't know what a straw would be from these guys. Is it like the proboscis? Do they have a proboscis? Since they're basically mosquitoes. See Rockbart. Even though we may be strong, we're still not that strong. This is, uh, this is gameplay, you know, quite a, quite a spectacle. Ricky saying bum smack. Ricky, you are a little devil, you know that. Man, you can't even call that a battle. You just hit it one time and it's dead. Oh, rough art. Oh, rough art.
Okay, I just need one more. Just need one more. Please give it to me. Actually, it'd be easier if I just did this. Okay. Who got a skill? Hmm. Huh. Alright, I... I've probably gotten skills off-screen. I don't... I don't remember. But probably, I switched Sharla to Devotion. As we finished that... that left one. But, uh... Healing arts and chain attacks. That may be good. I don't know. I've never done that. But it may it may be good. Alright. Now only six. We still need to kill a few things though. Strong enough to survive one hit. At least a little tiny bit. I don't need six of these. But this area is not as big as the leg. So it should be easier. is about to be the whole episode. Huh. Well, at least I title these correctly, so if you care about important stuff, you know it's a questing episode, so you know what you're getting.
Oh, Ricky got a skill. Nice. Which is that. Proves healing arts used on an 8 ally with half HP. Ricky has half HP, or the ally has half HP? I don't know. But I guess that's good. There we go. All right, now let's go turn it into Werner. Who is here at a weird time. When is he here? Hmm. Hello. I knew you'd come through for trusty Werner. Now I can make my butterfly biscuits and my... Well, I suppose I should tell you. My butterfly ribbons. Told you it was embarrassing. They'll make a great tie-in product to go with biscuits, huh? Watch this space, fellow believers. They'll be the next big thing. Alright. This time next year, I'll be a millionaire. Got a lot of work to do. Catch you later. It's biscuits and ribbons, huh? It's biscuits and ribbons. Okay, sure, why not? I need to mark the skill that Ricky got. Okay. So there's that. And I guess... I guess I should go recruit people, huh? Alright. Also, if you were curious, Colony 6 gets up to level 5. So we're about... A quart, quart, quarter? Done? Maybe? Hmm. Alright, let me see. Who can I recruit? I can go recruit some Nopon. And recruit Hoko. is Hoko. Huh? Huh? 
you. Oh god, so angry he's going to burst. Hoko leave village right now. Me not going to cook for no one in this smelly nasty village. Hoko will start his own restaurant in another village. How about you do that in Colony 6? Yes, Hoko want to go Colony 6. Come on friends, we go now. There are lots of different people in Colony 6 who eat Hoko's food. Hoko's food going to make Colony 6 famous. Alright, there you go, there's him. And now he shows up there. Alright, there's Hoku. I think I can get another guy. Change it to night time. Go to the plaza. Poka Poka. Poka Poka is a proud gourmet food critic with a tongue like no other. But Poka Poka's tasting skills are not really needed here in village. That is why Poka Poka wants to move to Colony 6. Poka Poka hears there are quite a few people there. He knows just there are lots of new treats to sample. Yes, come, come, come. Hey, that's great. Poka Poka will taste food as he helps with the reconstruction. Poka Poka can't wait to search out rare foods and delights. There you go. And now he's there. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Can I get anyone else? No one from here. I can get... Looks like two people from Alcomoff, though. Let us go get to them. I need to find Talonith and Makrish. So hopefully this is Talonith right here. Yes, indeedy. You know, I hate to sound conceited. There's no one in the city who thinks my dishes are not good. And so, now I wish to open a restaurant somewhere else. But there, where would be a good place to try out? Hmm, Golan, things. Such a place exists. Please allow me to open up there. I shall make dishes that please all of the peoples of Bionis. Thank you, thank you. And now, he's there. And then where is Makrish? In the palace. There you go. I think that everyone by honest can live in harmony. And when I know of you, I'd say you think the same thing too. Could you help me find a place where everyone thinks this way? Colony 6 is pretty, pretty good, you know. Thank you so much. I'm so glad I plucked up the courage to ask you. I was worried you might say no. Thank you again. Alright. And now, she's there. Very much like how this works. Got four new people. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure. Yeah. 
That's all the people we can move right now. Right, and well, before we end this, let's go there and see what quests they have. Where is Hoko? Oh, here's Hoka Hoka. Hoko in deep trouble right now. Hoko hardly have time to think. Hoko in trouble because Hoko cooking up bit by storm. Customers get sick from his food. Customers never finish Hoko's food and sometimes run away. Hoko must beat other restaurant to survive or business died soon. Hoko need better ingredients to beat Winghead Cook. That's why friends are here, to find Hoko good ingredients. I had the pleasure of sampling one of your dishes. I must say, I truly believed a part of my soul died. You are mean, mean, Hom Hom. If you think better ingredients will swing the battle in your favor. Please, friends. Can friends turn blind eye to all these suffering people? I just need stuff. Thank you, friends. Now Hoko's yucky slop become food fit for emperors and kings. Hurry back. Alright, there's his. McCrish. We need Ricky in the party, so that's good. Hi there. Oh, what can I do? Oh, it's you again. Thank you kindly. I must share something with you. I've always practiced acceptance of other cultures and people. That's why back in Alchemoth I lived with a Nopon boy. But one day he just up and left. I'm worried he might be lost and hungry, or worse. Ricky feel for bird girl. It not like good Nopon little pond to run away from kind bird lady. You understand, good. But let's not get sidetracked by me being correct. Yes, Ricky sorry. What a good little thing you are. I've searched for him everywhere, but you see, but I can't find him. Would you be so kind to slend a hand in his search? We need Nopal Rick. Wasn't he in Alchemoth? I'm truly grateful. His most striking character traits are that he's shy but quite cheeky. He enjoys playing by grassy areas and goes by the name Nopal Rick. I gave him that name, by the way. Good luck, and I hope you find him safe. Well, this seems like the easiest quest ever. Pretty sure we, we can just find him. Alright, and I th that's... That's actually the only ones we can accept, because the future ones... We need to finish these ones first. But okay. I think I'll end it there. I feel like we, we did, like... Nothing. But we got two quests done, a whole two, but we invited more people, so that's definitely good progress. Alright, well, I've been player one, and I'll see you next time when I think we'll, we'll do some story. Alright, bye bye.